Hi guys! Welcome back to our channel! This is Ivy Marie Alnidea and today, I'll show you how to make a creative flat transitions in Microsoft PowerPoint 2016. Do you really know what flat transitions are? Flat transitions are motion effects that occur in slideshow view when you move from one slide to the next during a presentation. You can control the speed, add sound, and even customize the properties of transition effects. With that, I'm going to teach you two creative flat transitions in MS PowerPoint 2016. So for the first example, we have Circle Blast. Open your Microsoft PowerPoint. Go to Insert, click Shapes, and choose Oval. Press the shape while you're sizing the shape. Change its outline to No Outline and fill to red. Go to Animations tab, choose More Entrance Effects, and choose Basic Zoom. Set Start with Previews. Press Add Animation, and choose Grow or Shrink Effect. Set the duration to 1.20 seconds. And set Start with Previews. Change the smooth end to its full size and smooth start to 0.3 seconds. Change the size to 1,200%. Align the circle to the middle of the slide and bring it to the right of the slide so that half of it is not visible. Then duplicate the circle and change the shape fill. Resize the circle into an oval, then rotate it a little bit and bring it to the bottom left corner of the slide. Change the delay to 0.30 seconds. Duplicate the oval and change the shape fill. And bring it to the top left corner of the slide. Make the delay of the animation into 0.50 seconds. Resize it until it covers the whole screen. Or slide rather. So here, we're just going to add text. For the second one, we have Wipe Up Transition. Open your Microsoft PowerPoint. Go to Insert tab, click Shapes, and choose Rounded Rectangle. Set the size width to 4 inches, and change its outline to No Outline and Fill to Yellow. And align it with Left. Round it up the corners and increase its size length. Go to Animations tab and choose Fly In. Set the duration to 0.80 seconds.
increase its smooth end to its full size. Set start with previews. Duplicate the shape and change the effect options from top. Select all of them and duplicate. Duplicate the slide and remove the last shape. Select all of them and horizontally rotate them. Then, decrease the size length to 3 inches. Then, from the animation pane, select the second one and move it to the top. Next, arrange them accordingly. So, the first one should be aligned to the center, then to the top. The second one should be aligned to the center, then to the middle. Then the last one should be aligned to the middle, then to the bottom. Select all of them and increase their sizes. There should be no gap in between them. Go to Animation Pane and choose the Animation Flyout. Click the Effect Options and choose to the left. Increase its smooth start. Then set the duration to 0.80 seconds. Select Start with Previews. Click the second one and change the effect options to right. So yeah, that is it for my video. If you want more video tutorial, let me know down below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be notified whenever we upload a new video. See you guys in our next one. Don't forget, STEM3 is amazing. Bye!